Yeah, good morning to everybody. So we will start. So last week we ended year, right, sir? Yes, sir. So we need to start from here. Trayam Sharja Vishwa Bhaga Icha Chatur Bahi Sahito Ravihi Dhumo Nama Mahadosha Sarva Karma Vinashaka Dhumo Mandala Taha Shuddho Vyati Pato Atra Doshada Shashad Botraha Vyati Pataha Parivesho Ati Dosha Kruta Parivesha Chayuta Chakradi Indra Chapastu Doshada Vitrayam Shadjadi Bhaga di Chapaha Ketu Kago Ashubaha Ekarashi Taha Ketuhu Surya Tulyaha Prajayati Aprakasha Grahat Chaite Papa Dosha Pradahas Murutaha Non luminous Upagrahas, subplanets. Add four signs, thirteen degrees and twenty minutes of arc to the sun's longitude at the given moment to get the exact position of all in a species Duma. So, so Duma is a one supplant. Reduce Duma from uh, all signs to arrive Vatipata. Vatipata. Vatipata is also in a species. Add six signs to Vatipata to know the position of Parivesha. He is extremely in a species. Detect Parivesha from 12 signs to arrive to the, at the position of Chapa, who is also in a species. Add 16 degrees 40 minutes to Chapa, which will give Ketu, Upaketu, who is malefic. By adding a sign to Upaketu, you get the original longitude of the sun. These are the planets devoid of splendor, which are malefic by nature and cause affliction. The, uh, Appara Kasa uh, Grahas and our uh, Upagrahas are to be calculated as under base on the above four verses. Sun plus 133 degrees 20 minutes, Dhumma. Dhumma plus 53 degrees 20 minutes, Vyatipata. Vyatipata plus 180 degrees is Parivesha. Parivesha minus 53 degrees 20 minutes, Indra Chapa. Chapa plus 16 degrees 40 minutes is Upaketu, Sikhi. Upaketu, if increased by 30 degrees, will reach the sun exact position at the given moment. Let us assume the sun is in towers 10 degrees and calculate the five upagrahas as under. Okay. You can read all these things. It may be seen that by adding 30 degrees to Upaketu, the last calculated upagraha, we reached sun's original point, which is basis of upagraha calculations. Given uh, a uh, list of upagrahas, uh, uh, in English we will ca uh, call as uh, satellites. So moon is also satellite, but he made it as a graha, so, uh, which is the earth satellite, the moon is graha. So he, he given place in the graha, but uh, he given uh, these uh, Duma, Yutipata, Parivesha, Chapa, Upaketu, those are uh, upagrahas, satellites. So we, we will not consider all these things in uh, uh, while calculating the charts. Just for Muhurta basis, those kind of things we will see. Some of the professional astrologers who are well versed uh, in the astrology, they will see all these things also. Uh, even uh, my father used to uh, see Gulika, Gulika concept. Uh, and uh, some other things uh, he will also calculate. So. Uh, we, I did not give any preference for this. Okay, if anybody want to uh, elevate some uh, some more things on these, uh, you can. Yes, uh, these five uh, upagrahas, the, uh, Parashara called them as upagrahas. The Dhuma, Vyati, Pata, Parivesha, Chapa, Upaket. So these are all because uh, upagrahas, they are uh, beyond the sun, uh, Saturn place. Anyway, Saturn taking one sign transiting is a pond of years. 
it's a long it takes long time so these upagrahas will take more than that even uh, in uh, western uh, astrologers they are taking like, like uh, uh, uranus uh, neptune pluto those are all uh, take lot of time one sign that transit at least 50 years one sign uh, other one is uh, 70 years one sign so if one person born in the middle of any sign what you put my If anyone born in the initial stage of suppose uh, the Neptune whatever you are taking is an external planet in the beginning of any sign. So it takes changing of that sign, it takes 70 years. So we can't uh, see any difference regarding that. If the one planet is what we are delineating in any astrology by house, if planet is sitting in one particular house, so these are the characteristics. Until unless the planet goes, changes the sign, there is a change. So that's why you can't see in your lifetime, in our recent years, if the person is living 70 years, 80 years, there is not much change. So that's why most of the people now is a... ignoring those planets but parashara marshi is clearly mentioned these also they will have their role until unless you go inside and see what exactly they will most of them is a malefic only so if you want to see any malefic uh, detail information we need to check these planets also these also we can calculate easy uh, by giving the method just adding subtracting degrees to sun then you'll get the those planet places but in uh, if you re- use the, that free software jagannatha hora software which is my friend uh, p r narsimha rao he, he included gulika and man they are the son and daughter of the saturn they are most malefic more than the saturn you can say that 10 times of saturn 10 times of rahu wherever gulika mandi sits in, in any house so we need to observe once we observe we'll come to know what are their roles what are the effect of getting the person so we'll go to next shloka suryendu lagno shveshu vamshayarjuna ಲಾಡ್ ಬ್ರಹ್ಮ the lotus born if sun is afflicted by one of these upagrahas the native dynasty will not spread so to say there will be a loss of all sons and lack of sons if the ascendant is afflicted short life will come to pass the moon is in the grip of upagraha <coughs> it will cause the mental afflictions through the text denotes conjunction of upagraha with the sun we better treat it as affliction for the sun can never be conjunct any of the five upagrahas except vetipata as can be seen from the example calculation actually these upagrahas if you, if you use any software they are not also including these upagrahas in any software but calculation the horoscope so <clears throat> these we need to uh, need to refrain and re- research more on uh, what are the effects so many people are researched uh, nine navagrahas and even temples also they only uh, telling that only we have nine navagrahas other things are not necessary so a temple also consisting they are uh, um, giving pujas to only nine navagrahas so it's up to uh, your part whether to take all these things in uh, uh, while horoscope reading or we want to leave it um, sir you can uh, continue sir, if you want to say yeah this okay is a very deep subject going into sub, uh, sub planets 
so it comes in the next uh, wherever uh, in the coming chapters we will discuss there so if you discuss now also is there is no point until unless you add them in the calculation <coughs> next shloka ravi varadishanyantam gulikaadi nirupchate divasana shthada bhakta vareshad ganet krama Ashtamo amsho narisha syachanya amsho gulika hasmurtaha Ratri mavyashtada krutva vareshat panchama ditaha Ganadeshtamaha khando nishyatihi parikir titaha Shanyamsho gulikaha Prokto ravyam shaha kala samjakaha Bhaumam sho mruchura disto Guruam sho Yamaghantaka Somyam sho Arda Praharaka Swaswade sho Bhava has putta. The calculations of Gulika, the portions of the sun, you see, up to Saturn, denote the periods of Gulika and others, divide the day duration of a, any week. Weekday into eight equal parts. The eighth portion is lordless. The seven portions are distributed to seven planets, commencing from the lord of the weekday. Whichever portion is ruled by Saturn will be the portion of Gulika. Similarly, make the night duration into eight equal parts and distribute these commencing from fifth week lord. Here again, eighth portion is lordless while Saturn portion is Gulika, the Sun portion is Kala, the Mars portion is Mithri, Mercury, Mercury. Jupiter portion is Yama, Gantaka, and Mercury's portion is Artha, Prahara. These different, differently apply to the different places. <clears throat> so Artha, Prahara, Yama, Gantika, Mrityu, Kala, and Gulika are the five Kala Velas suggested by the sage. The day duration according to latitude is divided into eight equal parts. The eighth portion is unloaded. The first portion is allotted to the weekday lord. Other portions follow in order of the weekday lords. We consider five planetary portions, ignoring that of the moon and Venus. The portions of the sun, Mars, Mercury, Jupiter, and Saturn are respectively called Kala, Mrityu, Ardha, Prahara, Yamagantika and Gulika. In the case of night, the duration of one by eight parts are allotted in different order. The first portion goes to the planet, ruling the fifth weekday lord counted from the day in the question. The others follow in usual order. Here again, eighth part is lordless. The planetary positions of Kala to Gulika are the same in nomic nature in the night also. Gulikas and Mandi are uh, one and the same and not different. This is one by the statement of Parasara, by Brahat Parasara Horas as the fourth sloka, Benaras Hindi edition of uh, Chukamba Sanskrit. Chaukamba Sanskrit Samstham, the big uh, publisher in North. Uh -huh. Na Namantram to Tasya Iva Mandir. Iti ya bhi diyate. The quarter is not available in our version. In this connection, please refer to Prashna Marga and Jataka Parajata. Kira Nuru Nataraja of Jataka Alankaran, Tamil version given signs on dignities of Opagrahas and Gulika ITC. So, Gulika, <coughs> see here. Uh, um, uh, so uh, each day in Hora are all divided into seven planets and uh, there is no uh, day allotted for Rahu and Jain. So in each day, they subdivided a small portion of one hour to Rahukala and Yamaganta. Yamaganta means Ketu ruling. So each day, Rahu and Ketu will rule each day. There is a Rahu column at a specific time and Yamagandam. 
Yamagandha means ruling by Ketu. So these will be incorporated in each and every day. They did not alerted uh, Rahu, Rahu day or Ketu day separately, seven days for a week. So Rahu and Ketu were alerted in each and every day. And there is also a Gulika Kala, which is a Gulika, uh, they mentioned in the ancient text as the son of the Saturn. So Gulika means repetition. Whatever you do in Gulika Kala, it will repeat again. Suppose I have uh, 10 lakhs of uh, debt. So if, if you pay 1000 rupees at Gulika Kala, it will repeat again and again so that the amount will be, you will be cleared with amount in very soon. So, so there is a uh, video on this Gulika Kala, which is made by my father. That is very useful. If you want to pay your debts, use the Gulika Kala. Don't marry in Gulika Kala. It will repeat again and again. So you will get more <laughs> wives. <laughs> so, well, Rahu Kala, uh, Rahu Kala, the desires will be ex excavated. So you will be more desirous uh, and Rahu Kala. So the, there, uh, there are some uh, prayers and uh, pujas and the Rahu Kala to uh, decrease that power of uh, excavation of uh, the desires. Sir, Yamaganda, I, uh, Yamaganda, I will complete the Yamaganda and uh, we'll discuss that. Okay, Yamaganda sir. is the is a, a time where we we will not think. Uh, some some people are uh, going towards uh, uh, railway track without seeing trains. Okay, so they are they are in uh, out of mind, uh, Yamaganda. So that uh, the death will conquer. So the Rishi is alerted that Rahukala and Yamaganda be careful. Just given alert, it is like. You will face Yamaganda means Yama means you will see the uh, god of death. So you were headless at that time. So there are some uh, things there, uh, Barasra given hints. Uh, okay, remaining things, uh, even I don't know. Indra Chapa, Upa Ketu, Yamaganda, uh, Yamaganda, I know, Ketu, Ketu ruling Yamaganda. Uh, Ardha Prahara, what is Ardha Prahara? I don't know. Kala, Murukyu, I don't know. Yamaganta is Yamaganta, sir. Yamaganta. That is the same. Ah, Gulika, same. Gulika Kalam, we are using nowadays everywhere. Uh, yeah. Mamdi, Gulika, Gulika uh, Yamagandam, mm -hmm. these are all common. Next immediate level. So the remaining Upaketu, Artha Prahara, Kala, Murchu, these are very deep again. So even in Panchanga also, uh, maybe we need to go back around 50, 100 years back, Panchangas, maybe they would have mentioned. But now, think, day by day, uh, everyone is simplified. Yeah, I think Yamagantaka is Yamaganda and Duma is Rahukala. Gulika is Gulika. Gulika is separate. Gulika is there. Yeah, Gulika is the same. It follows. If you just seen in the software that the Jagannath Hora, you will find it in everybody's chart. Where it, where it is, exactly. Gulika and Mandi, they play a crucial role to, for ascertaining any chart. Yeah, someone is asking doubt. Who is that? Sir, myself. Sir, if we do good things in Gulika Kala, will they be repeated? Yes, sir. Don't marry. <laughs> not, not marriage, other things, other good things. Yeah, yeah. It's basically where people will say to clear the debts. Okay. At least okay. you pay one rupee. Okay. So that uh, the, your debts will be cleared very soon. So for okay. that, it is famous. Gulika Kala is famous. So uh, auspicious things they will not uh, do in Gulika Kala because it may repeat. Suppose if you marry at Gulika Kala, it will repeat. Why it will repeat? If your wife will die, then only you will do another marriage, right? Yeah, okay. Right. So that's why they will avoid auspicious things in Gulika Kala. Okay, okay. Got because you, after you are losing something, then again you will go to that thing, right? Mm -hmm. So we will avoid the, those things in uh, Gulika Kala. So better to clear the depths as per the uh, my my father or my elders, gurus okay. teachings, use the Gulika Kala for clearing depths. Okay, sir. Okay. Thank you.
sir uh, what is the name sir you introduce yourself baskar baskar okay i know <laughs> <laughs> okay baskar you i think you need to change again remove that extra r from your name yeah i removed sir i am not doing i am not following that i am using but I'm still doing... it is showing here with the double r okay i think uh, <laughs> long back used it sir yeah okay <laughs> change it yes from the sun to saturn no one is exalted in the above mentioned exaltation signs nor debilitated in the above mentioned debilitated signs out of the five color velas gulika it is four except kala related to the sun have own sign system in the respective signs ruled by their fathers gulika son of saturn has aquarius as own sign jupiter father sun father sign father sign <laughs> jupiter's son yamaghantaka has its in sagittarius a uh, ardha prahara mercury's son is in own sign in gemini mercury son of mars has scorpio as own sign it is not known why kala the son of sun shifted to capricorn a sign of his brother uh, saturn leaving the father leo obviously saturn has given his uh, moola trikona to his son gulika while he gave capricorn to his brother kala that's it sir yeah <laughs> next गुलिके अष्ट वशालग्न स्फुट युलिक प्रोच्यते तस्तक फल gulka affects for the particular nativity be estimated the day duration or night duration as the case may be a calculation of the five kala velas by a gulika etc be consider the latitude of birth some authority suggest to use the end of the period for ascertaining longitudes of this says parasara view is correct in this respect as exemplified in the notes of the shloka 25 to 30 chapter <laughs> mandi and gulika are interchanged in own text to mean one and the same so he described about gulika all those things so it is up to you to uh, it is muhurta uh, prediction and uh, muhurta jataka muhurtam so while calculating different auspicious events we will uh, go for muhurta so in calculation of muhurta these things will be considered carefully so uh, is there any, any magandam or rahu kalam or uh, kulika so it will be avoided while while uh, fixing a muhurta for marriage so we need to go in a deep research uh, to find uh, what are this i don't i don't have any knowledge on this okay if anybody want to uh, add sum up uh, to these things welcome actually these are used to uh, get the finer level even say, saying like murtha selection if you want to see very finest moment without any afflictions the time should be purest without any malefic effect so because these are upagrahas are so considered as a malefics we see only nine planets level but still if you want to go in the next level for better muhurta so they need to look for these planets position also that's why he is uh, discussing about this gulika position mandi position so while taking murta need to seek carefully and consider the time next sir sir do you apply them in this sir sir seeing anything no sir because sir. we don't have that much time to look for uh, we are in sir. a fast yoga Okay. We are in a very, very, very fast yoga. Just uh, open the Google and look for it and tell. 
practical so, application is less than that that's what even uh, that's why results also will be like that so some of the will be benefited some of will be is not working what we expected so that's why uh, the people okay. come back to again astrology so not that fellow is given prediction is not coming out so the either both side there is a problem so we need to if you want to see we need a popular uh, proper time to estimate the exact position of all these things it's not possible in one day uh, so murta calculation will take enormous time according to you exactly is a murta is not not like that right? so you need to see correct, many correct. things and you need to see the person chart then you look for a correct muhurta by see he mentioned parashara mentioned all these sub planets you need to look for them so where we get again you need to calculate most of them in manually some softwares are not all softwares i i don't see uh, they are given in the you need to calculate manually it takes time i first of all you need a lot of knowledge on this what are they and what to be seen it yeah, and how they affect the particular chart that also needs to be studied yes you, you need information exactly yeah, without correct. the background knowledge what is the point of looking them yes 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 correct so we'll go next bamsha pada samay pranai charadhyar katrikona bhat उदयादि यद्भम् प्राणप्रदम् प्राणपदम् स्वस्ते कालम् फलीकृत्य तिथ्यादिकम चरागादि वसंस्ते अर्के भौमे भौनो यदमे सुते स्फुट प्राणप्रदाख्या तल्लग्न ज्ञेय द्विजोत्तम लग्नाने तुरीये राज्य प्राणप्रदम तदा शुभ जन्म विज्ञानीयश अन्यस्थाने स्थित चेत सैदा जन्माशुभ वदे कैलकुलेशन ऑफ प्राणपद कन्वर्ट द गिवेन टाइम इनटू Vigatikas and divide the same by 15. The resultant Rashi degrees it is be added to the sun if he is in a movable sign, which will yield Pranapada. If the sun is in a fixed sign, add 240 degrees additionally, and if in dual sign, add 120 degrees in furtherance to get a Pranapada. The birth will be auspicious if Pranapada falls in second, fifth, ninth, fourth, tenth. Or eleventh from the natal ascendant. In other houses, prana pada indicates an auspicious birth. So <clears throat> this is birth time calculations. The calculation of uh, prana pada lagda is exemplified below as per the above slokas. Assume birth is sixteen gadis, twenty-five vigadis. When this is converted into vigati kas, we get nine eighty-five divided by fifteen. This yields sixty five point six six Rashi, which means sixty five signs and twenty degrees, expanding the multiples of twelve. We have five degrees twenty seconds, five seconds twenty degrees, and no, no, five signs, five signs. Five S means five S, five signs twenty degrees. It means Virgo, Virgo twenty degrees. The next step is to add the straight away. So the sun's longitude, if he is in a movable sign, suppose the sun is in Aries, 15 degrees, we get 170 plus 15, 185. Or Libra, 5 degrees as Pranaprada ascendant. ascendant. In the same example, if the sun is in fixed sign, say Taurus, sir, we can skip this. <laughs> <laughs> No, no. How to calculate Pranapada is mentioned. This is a simple thing. So Pranapada lagna is used in mostly in Gemini system. Parashara is. Uh, I don't see people are using Pranapada things. But in Gemini, Maharshi is used all the lagnas. Most of them. many lagnas are starting from main lagna to uh, 
ఆరూఢ లగ్న ఉపపద లగ్న ప్రాణపద లగ్న మెనీ అదర్ థింగ్స్ సార్ సో హౌ టు క్యాల్కులేట్ దట్స్ వైస్ హియర్ సార్ బిఫోర్ గోయింగ్ ఐ విల్ టెల్ వన్ రియల్ టైమ్ సిచ్యువేషన్ వాట్ ఈస్ హ్యాపెనింగ్ నవ్ డేస్ సో పీపుల్ విల్ కమ్ టు మై ఫాదర్ ఫర్ మ్యారేజ్ ముహూర్తం ఓకే సో మై ఫాదర్ విల్ ఆస్క్ వెన్ యు ఆర్ గోయింగ్ టు వెన్ ఐ నీడ్ టు ఫిక్స్ విత్ ఇన్ టూ మంత్స్ సార్ ఐ విల్ సో మై ఫాదర్ విల్ సి ఆల్ ద డేట్స్ ఇన్ ద టూ మంత్స్ అండ్ విల్ ఫిక్స్ సమ్ ఆఫ్ ద డేట్స్ ఫర్ ముహూర్తం ఫర్ మేకింగ్ అ మ్యారేజ్ దెన్ పీపుల్ విల్ ఆస్క్ సార్ you kept marriage muhurta at midnight okay <laughs> nobody will come so put it in day time so that uh, we will uh, keep a dinner or a lunch for them so please uh, make it flexible so then my father will move again will uh, recheck and uh, he will move to the day time then they will tell sir please saturday or sunday no <laughs> weekdays sir so saturday then, sunday only uh, the people will come sir all are doing software jobs they were no thing sir then why you need to come to astrology to ask for <laughs> you have your own time available time and fix it and call the people so then there is no need of any astrology to fixing the moon moon <laughs> is as per your chart that is a suitable time that is comes in a 24 hours time wherever it is possible is a midnight or mid midday you can't say that right <laughs> so then uh, my father stopped uh, keeping these muhurtas for marriage <laughs> useless <laughs> real uh, useless. Yeah. because uh, there is no see this vivaha muhurta whatever the charts if they are uh, having strong or weak aspects or uh, weak planets in the chart of uh, 7th house the muhurta will uh, strongly bind the link between the uh, um, bride and bridegroom so the muhurta will have that much capacity to go through any obstacles between them so but nowadays they are not giving any prominence they are not uh, see they are not able to call the people so uh, in olden days if a marriage is happening so throughout town they will call uh, they will uh, send the, all the invitation to all the people uh, thousands of members will come and uh, bless the uh, couple so that in that thousand people if one if one uh, truth person who is having that power of truth and uh, purity in his heart he if he blesses that couple that that itself is enough for them throughout life so for, but nowadays people hesitate to calling uh, only two families enough sir we, we won't call anyone so we will you live streaming in whatsapp or uh, youtube <laughs> people will see so i seen one reception where there is no boy who is getting married uh, there is no boy he is living in uh, uh, some london or something he is not okay. having any dates so they are giving live stream from london to mm. india okay so they are projecting in a tv so here they are making uh, that reception where the rings will be exchanged right so yeah. they are exchanging like that it is happening now it is marriage so we are not giving any prominence to muhurta or uh, for a marriage culture of the marriage it is completely deviating we heard in some uh, mythology stories even in uh, some kings used to do that they send their uh, what is a katga so they need to marry the girl to the katga only they sh- then she will come to the kingdom that was there because of his king but now so making utilize of all these things what the technology is giving by people are moving away uh, the reality what vedas told what our sanskrit is mentioned so that's why the people also get suffer in the same way so is expected so what you do you will get the same it is it is yuga dharma sir this is all uh, like polluted yeah sir. you call it yuga dharma whatever it is but the, the procedure is mentioned procedure is available so what to follow what not to follow that is your that is your conscience you need to think it right so you are in, giving yeah. importance to other things which, yes, which is correct, more yeah. important you are ignoring which is not important you are taking that is important so nobody can help so is everybody self
so with this we completed chapter uh, 3 now this is author rashi swarupadhyaya this is characteristics of signs how they are described uh, sir ravi sir will continue or will discuss anything if anybody want to talk on these things please. yes sir anybody Welcome, all people. Uh, sir, good morning, sir. Nagaraj here. Yes, yeah, sir. Good morning. Sir, uh, sir the, I have a doubt, but not related to the topic what we just discussed with just now. It's something else look, about uh, astrology only, but not related to the topic that was discussed now. Is it okay or like, or you'll go ahead with the next step? I'll ask later. We are in the mode of marriage. We are in the mode of marriage. Marriage. <laughs> <laughs> you can, no, you can. Sir, now Shukra is Asta, no? You can't, uh, no marriage. Shukra, yeah. Yeah, Shukra mode, yeah, me. It's called Shukra mode, yeah. Yeah. So marriage may be after some time. <laughs> Shukra mode, yeah, me, it, it's like uh, Astamayam. Astamayam means a sun setting, right? Yeah, yeah. So, yeah, yeah, yeah. Almost, uh, Shukra, Shukra, no, Astama means no. Shukra, uh, uh, Venus no, no, is I, setting. Yeah, Shukra, no, no. I know the meaning. I since you said you are talking about marriage, I said we can't talk about marriage like that. I said. <laughs> yeah. yeah you okay. Can. What is your question then, sir? Like, see, when uh, these uh, uh, the four signs are there, no, Ag uh, Agni Tattva, Bhu Tattva, Jala Tattva Rashi is like hmm. Jala Tattva Rashi is. I know they are mainly predominantly emotions which shows what Jala Tattva. Like that. What What does the Bhu Tattva Rashi show? Bhutatva means they are ground to earth, means ground to earth. It's a practical. Bo both the Bhutatva show the same practical nature? Bhutatva means it's only practical. They won't, they won't go with emotional. They won't go... Uh -huh. Okay, okay. Uh -huh. They won't... Uh, it's a Bhutatva means mostly people uh, like doctors, lawyers. Uh, who are more practical oriented. Practical oriented. Okay. And what about Vayu? Vayu is they mainly depend on their imagination. Communicative. Communicative imagination. <clears throat> uh -huh. They are not as practical compared to this Bhutatva Rashi. Yes. Bhutatva means uh -huh. practical. They, they want to okay. see with their... They want practical. They want proof. Uh -huh. Without proof, they want to accept. Materialistic. Uh -huh. Materialistic. Yeah, you can say materialistic. Exactly. Yes. Which one? Bhutatva. Bhutatva. Uh -huh. They and, want uh, cars. They want real estate, properties, money. Oh, okay. And uh, physical words, like you can say, material words. Materialistic. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. And uh, Agni, sir? Agni is a strength, uh, courage, valor, dharma. Yeah. No, what is their character? Like, you know, so as you said, this Bhutatva are more practical. The Agni mm -hmm. Tattva people are like more uh, powerful. Uh, what is forceful. That, their feeling? They are forceful. No, they, they are demand. forceful. They are forceful. They are action oriented. And they, they, follow, they follow the uh, rules. Mm -hmm. They follow the rules. Administrators. Administrators. Yeah. Action oriented mainly. You want uh -huh, to do okay. it, show in it by action. Uh -huh. They believe in action, right? Okay, okay, okay. Right. right, right. You know flower pots, sir? Flower pots. Yeah, yeah, flower pot, I know, sir. Uh -huh. So the mesha is like a flower pot. Uh -huh. One time, bus, it will go <laughs> top. Okay, Again, okay, okay. Oh, so, okay, okay. Full Leo, uh -huh. is, uh, Leo is like a bulb, okay? Uh -huh. Constant lighting. Okay. It will give constant lighting. Okay. And uh, Dhanasu is on off, where like a solar light. So uh -huh. if, if, uh, if there is a night, it will it will give light. If there is a uh, uh, sunshine, it will stop, stop and on and off. It will have that flexibility. Oh, I love, uh, more realistic, you can say. Yeah. yeah. See, uh -huh. uh, the uh, first I see here is. He's a starter. Okay? Mm -hmm. He will start the things. Mm -hmm. So the Leo will maintain which which he started in Aries. 
Ah, okay, okay. Yeah. So Sagittarius will finish up the things. Okay, okay. They are good finisher, like Dhoni. Ah. Uh-huh. So they have cool mind. They will uh, finish up the things. Okay, okay. You can say it is a hidden fire also. You can. A, hidden? Hidden, hidden fire. Fire. Camp okay, fire. okay. Camp These fire. are all fire signs, right? So. Yes, yes, correct. Aries, correct. Leo, and uh, Dhanus. Dhanus. These are yeah. fire signs. the fire will be changes is aries is a starting fire ha ah. leo is a maintains okay the fire will be maintained in a stable manner and dhanus is a hidden fire fire will be there but in hidden you can't see mm-hmm. okay okay yes sir got it got it Because I I always thought only that water element is the emotion. Other elements I couldn't get. So that was always my doubt. No, it's a, by seeing only. Who is the lord of those houses? See, ah. if you see fire signs. Who is the lord? Hmm. Mars. Leo yeah. sign lord sun. Sun. Then okay. says Jupiter. Yeah. So you can see that Mars is always is a fiery planet. He will start or anything without uh, thinking. you will take immediately gun and go immediately so no no next uh, thinking no second thought uh, impulsive like very impulsive uh, so whereas leo it will think it will it will may uh, it will maintain that level then only uh-huh. will take action ha uh-huh. ha after thinking <laughs> okay but uh, sagittarius jupiter you will not yeah. act immediately we will wait for the right time ah okay 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 well uh, knowledge is also there in uh, that's what he will not okay, work okay. like a mars or sun he will uh, he will work sun with extra also, knowledge he will sun is also wisdom. impulsive sir not impulsive he, he will think on that ah okay okay he maintains his status ah okay royal nature yes sir yeah okay. uh-huh. yeah someone is asking Sir, if you yeah. have seen Aries, the person will be the same, sir. He'll be action-oriented. He won't think before he do anything. Yes, exactly. Okay. Mars in Aries is a, is a is action. He will say first thing. Suppose there are hundred people. The one person is Mars in Aries. If you ask okay. anything, that that person only will come forward without thinking any consequence. Okay, I'm ready to do. That is a Mars. Aries. Like Mars. A... Wow. and what about um, scorpio mars sir scorpio mars also because is also his own sign but that that will be with the hidden thing i, okay. I will add sir it's a revenge thing. revenge mode of impulsiveness okay In aries and scorpio are ruled by mars in the aries the mars fighting ability can be seen practically we can see with our own eyes so he will fight with enemies outside in scorpio he will fight enemies inside that is kama krodha lobha moha panna marsarya so the fighting will be occur inside in aries fighting will occur outside so this But is what i want to say having yes. aspect the scorpio no sir if mars is in aries it will be aspecting that uh, scorpio so will he be able to conquer his inner enemies yeah 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 see yes. uh, mars is a fighter okay so if if uh, he will do for positive or negative it is controlled by moon <laughs> so whatever your heart will say so if if you attract to negative thing so he will fight for negative thing if you attract to positive thing he will fight for positive thing. okay got it sir. because king and queen are moon and sun right other planets will obey the orders of sun and moon yes okay ah uh, sir i just wanted to know this this pranpada lagna um uh, though it is mentioned but like when it is in the malefic houses does it affect the person in any way 
there are certain things need to check with pranapada lagna that's what he mentioned right in the, if the pranapada lagna is uh, the in these houses it will be good auspicious rest of the houses in auspicious you can see here but if pranapada falls in second house fifth and ninth fourth and tenth or eleventh from the natal ascendant is auspicious remaining houses are shows in auspicious that's what is mentioned marshal you can look that if you go to above how to calculate the pranapada lagna is mentioned even down also is given how to calculate this but some software is available in uh, jagannatha hora i think it is available which is free software you can install in your laptops not for mobile but laptops desktops you can use it this is one of the character characteristics you can check for this one okay sir and same about i wanted to know about this aparkashit grahas like gulika mandi and all this uh somewhere i i remember reading it that it is mentioned that if gulika is in lagna mm. at the time of birth mm. so it uh, nullifies all the raj yogas and everything in the chart yes he mentioned gulika mandi that's what i mentioned in the beginning they are equal to 10 times of saturn 10 times of rahu such a malefics wherever they sit that house is damaged simply if it is But sitting in lagna means your health is going to affect yes sir i think in yoga yoga also you can see that yoga which yoga is formed in lagna if the lagna is affected in the four yogas formed with the lagna those also will affect so uh, when we are checking a chart and uh, like the person is suffering like anything and we can't find any reason so should we check these also gulika where gulika is placed and whether where pranapada is must, falling must must these are the inner things right these are refined things you can see okay. that uh, in d sometimes d1 you can't find out you need to see in d9 okay okay thank you sir yeah very we are getting uh, the light light we discussed uh, five signs and uh, these effects it, it was quite interesting i um, got a deeper insight for the first time about this so can we discuss other signs also what is the difference between 2 6 and uh, 10 and uh, 3 7 11 so it will be quite educative Yes, that yeah, will come. I think in the next chapter. So, okay, Ravi sir, you give brief in things. Yeah, you you ask me. What what the, what is your question? No, no, we can. If it is coming in the further sessions, I will attend that only. Oh. No general things with the. Uh, yeah, general things. I want to know, like, what is the difference? The signs. Between, uh, fiery yes, signs. Yes. Yes. Uh, what is signs. the difference? See, all is one is uh, this third um, trikona. The second is earth trikona. So, how we quantify? Uh, what is the difference between two, six, and ten? Like we discussed one, five, and nine. It is very clear now. Two, six, and ten. Three, seven, eleven. Like, what is the difference? Yeah, it's a, uh, all are uh, same trikonas, but what is the dif difference between uh, the how it will impact the person? what sign yeah. it is yes yes we have there are more much more differences uh, we have four goals of life dharma artha kama moksha dharma trikona is 159 artha trikona is 2610 okay kama trikona is 3711 moksha is 4812 okay so based on this they divided the trikonas okay. so um, the five signs uh, 159 in the kalpursh kundali 159 so it exerts dharma righteous duties so they have energy with that energy you you want to utilize your energy for righteous things okay so the energy should not misused for wrong things so that is one purushartha <clears throat> ardha 26 10 so you want to uh, get ardha means meaning of your life 
not only money so artha what is the meaning artha means meaning artha means money so what is the meaning of your life what you will give more value what is the value uh, where you are giving the value so that will be t- uh, explained with the 2 6 uh, and 10 uh, so that is materialistic things the bhudatva rashis and 3711 is desire oh, the difference between these tendencies just like 159 we discussed uh, what are the difference between like if a planet is in aries or if it uh, it is in uh, leo or it is in sagittarius so same way what is the difference between uh, a planet being in 2 or 6 or 10 so yeah. their characteristics You, you are much more speed madam i am very slow you are rabbit i am a tortoise <laughs> sorry sir <laughs> so, <laughs> so, <laughs> you know the things sir 2610 is a uh, taurus and uh, virgo and uh, capricorn so yeah. capricorn is a starter okay so capricorn start the things okay it, it will give the materialistic uh, desire capricorn so and uh, the taurus will maintain that so it will it is a fixed sign so he is the starter capricorn is a starter so taurus is the fixed sign it will repeat the same thing the finisher is virgo so okay. he will finish the things okay so all the materialistic desires were, was controlled by these three sides so from the Cap- uh, capricorn is a starter and uh, the taurus is the maintainer and uh, virgo is finisher okay capricorn is brahma taurus is vishnu the finisher lord shiva is virgo okay is it is this you are asking or something else yes yes sir yes sir because these things helps a lot uh, like when you are studying a chart yeah yeah yeah, yeah. <laughs> same Brahma, way i want to know about other purusharthas also like what is the other rashis falling this yeah so uh, this is artha means materialistic world so what you will give more value will you give value to uh, buying a car buying a building or properties real estate so it depends it depends on the lagna okay it depends on the lagna what is coming in, in the second house okay suppose uh, if you take species like now okay the second house will become fire sign aries so uh, he he give more value to the righteous duties so the aries will become uh, is the second house so like that for lagna also it will see it is not fixed what what we are telling for each and every lagna it will move away yes okay? sir so if if i say aries is the first 159 uh, one is uh, uh, aries uh, five is leo and nine is uh, sagittarius if you take the species lagna it will come as 2610 because the species lagna want to do righteous duties he, they we they will give more value towards righteous duties yeah here just energy. i want to add one more thing you sir said uh, pisces lagna pisces lagna will have the artha trikona is a five signs right so artha trikona becomes 2 6 that becomes aries leo and dhanus these are the fiery signs means they want everything be in a righteous way in a truthful manner so pisces person the artha trikona should be in a righteous manner whatever is working 10000 is a working 6000 is a service second house is a your resources what you are going to earn by using all these things should be in a righteous manner that trikona is emphasizes the person should be particular related to money wealth he should be in a righteous manner if he is not maintained he will be in trouble so like that if it is a aquarius lagna what will happen these signs becomes 3711 373 seven, three means your mental wants 7 means karma 
these are kamatrikona the kamatrikona changes mentally body but uh, the eleven is your desires all these are kama but these should be in a, within a limit in a right manner right yes manner if they are not in a right yes manner again the person is going to suffer lot what planet is sitting suppose malefic sitting in this so the malefic will force the person to do in an illegal way illegal manner he never follow dharma or righteous methods if it is a benefit planet sitting that person will follow right path sir here i have one doubt sir hmm. sir if in a particular person horoscope if lagna lord and rasi lord are same but the rasi lord is sitting in dustana like 12th house but is but in his own sign like for example saturn if it is sitting in capricorn but it is in 12th house how will be the native's life sir you are again there are two different things rasi is different bhava is different lagna okay rasi the planet is sitting in rasi that is a different yeah. then you With- think about what is that bhava is it lagna bhava is it 12th bhava is it 6th bhava is need to apply them to lagna lord sitting in 12th house but own sign the yeah. planet will be is having the strength but that is a 12th house lagna lord into went to 12th house then the person is going to enjoy all the 12th house related matters you will okay. self lose you will you will lose everything in his own stupid things okay but planet is strong because it's sitting in own house for saturn okay. so the sign is different bhava is different you need to separate them and compile the things okay any more questions sir in kama trikona which is the initiator 3711 i think 3 is the initiator three, it's a cycle uh, it's a cycle starts from uh, see 11th house is desire again starts from it gemini uh, libra and uh, aquarius yeah so libra is the starter aquarius is fixed sign it will uh, maintain and uh, germany is a finisher yeah chara sthira viswavara rasi you need to see that one chara means is a initiator sthira means maintenance again same it comes brahma vishnu maheshwara the same rule apply to all the signs but libra chaos is aries Will heroism in relationship. <laughs> yes, Libra will have always uh, relationship problems. Uh, yeah, madam. Any more questions, madam? No, sir. Thank you. It was very nice. <laughs> Actually, these are the things will come in the going the chapters. We 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 want the immediate things, but we need to have a patience and read this. Uh, this is a very long and big book you need to go by chapter by chapter make it understand read it one not one time multiple times you will get to know many things inside yes sir my, my guru told that sir uh, if any person is having lagna lord in 12th house send him to other house not in the hometown don't keep <laughs> exactly. him exactly you need to go away place not in old so, hometown <laughs> like foreign to... yeah foreign means in uh, astrology suppose i am living in hyderabad if i go outside of hyderabad it is a foreign sir yes sir yes absolutely so, uh, in you see in uh, corporate culture foreign means us so in astrology foreign means if you go outside of your own place that is foreign one okay. one more word is used it's a 12th house is called uncomfortable place the lagna is a own house your own own place right but 12th house is a far away place not only far away it's a uncomfortable place suppose you are suppose you from vijayawada you came to hyderabad so you don't have 
in in your Rijayawada, you have a very big house. Every many things, everything will get in a right time, right right way. But okay. if once come in a Hyderabad, you need to live in, in a very small, uncomfortable zone, uncomfortable tam- place. Yeah, with the lacking comforts. Yes, that is a twelfth house. Okay, okay. Aquarius Lagna is a typical one. Then Aquarius Lagna Lord Saturn is sitting in Capricorn. Capricorn is own house. So twelfth house is own house. So Aquarius people, if example, if you say take a scientist, humanitarian people are will come in Aquarius. Okay, they always want to uplift the society. Yes. So uplift the standards of society. They will invent a bulb by sacrificing whole life. Yes. Okay. They will give. Uh, they will uh, keep water. Uh, in the, okay. They will donate water in the summer. They will give clothes in winter. They will donate. So those humanitarian kind of people and uh, who the people who uh, want to uplift the society will come in Aquarius like now. Yes. So what they will lose? They will lose Capricorn. Capricorn means what? Hard work. Say they always lose their hard work. Okay. But uh, in involving humanitarian works, they will lose their time. Yes, by cost okay. of their and, comforts. Uh, by the cost of their comforts, they leave it everything. <laughs> they 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 never look for self things. They forget everything, their wealth or whatever it is. They only the goal is to help society. But it is good thing, no sir. <laughs> no, no. For you, good. Outsiders, good. For himself, what is thing? He's losing, right? Okay. He's losing his comfort. He's losing his a... patience. He's a peace. Is a luxury, whatever it is. I will tell you one joke, sir. I have a friend, a scientist, in working in DRDL. Okay, so DRDL is the testing area of all the rackets, all those things. So whatever the military machinery, they will test in DRDL. So he is the scientist in that DRDL. Yes, sir. I so worked I for two years in DRDL. <laughs> I, I he invited me. He invited me. I went to his home, and uh, their children are playing there. So, uh, and uh, I asked him, uh, uh, "Your son, uh, which uh, standard he is studying? Which class he is studying?" He, he, within one second, he, he, he thinking about uh, which standard, and uh, he told fifth class. Then uh, his son came and, uh, and told to me, "No, uh, uncle, I am seventh standard." <laughs> so he forgot what his son is studying. Huh? Is that much, so that much yeah. hard work for the society, they will uh, they will lose their time, okay, dedicating to society. So even personal level, they ignore those things. That is the fault. Hope you understand what I'm. Um, <laughs> what? <laughs> it's a typical thing. <clears throat> you you have a curious like no. Your is a yeah. yes. That's what he's asking. Yeah. So, <laughs> so like, on your personal uh, level. Whatever Lagna you are having, and like th- uh, third house is Prakarma Bhava. So, does it in any way imply about what kind of actions person will be doing? Which Lagna? Whichever Lagna. Yeah, yeah, yes. 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 So, Prakarma. like uh, for Aquarius only, taking we are taking. So, uh, in Prakarma Bhava, the Rashis are one five nine. Uh, sorry, yes. one yes. Aries. Yes. So, his actions will be uh, dharma oriented. Yes. Right. Yes. No, it should be. Uh, what I am telling, the signs, the signs are there, fiery signs, right? Yes. So you will be. He will have some action oriented because of their fiery signs sitting in a karma. But there are every sign is having good or bad. What yes, side sir. you are inclined based on the planets there? Sir, if Lagna is aspected by good planets like Jupiter, how will that person be? What is, is that Jupiter? Person? Jupiter is again which sign lord? That is also matters. Not just Jupiter. Jupiter is a malefic sign. Suppose sixth lord, twelfth lord, eighth lord. No, if it is a, Lagna. Second and eleventh lord. If he is second and eleventh lord, and he's yeah, aspect- second. And, yeah, that's right. Second and seventh, eleventh lord is okay. Benefit to that sign. Okay. 
so is a benefit to that sign you will give inclination to how to earn money sir will follow the path of dharma only no this is doesn't matter right path of dharma or not is aspecting oh, second house jupiter 11th house if jupiter is in 7th house yeah. he will get a wife uh, as a teacher <laughs> you need to listen to her <laughs> every day he will she will give homework for you <laughs> yeah lessons teaching guide she will be guide <laughs> jupiter is a guide in any chart yeah so sir, my to... husband is hello sir my husband is having retrograde uh, jupiter in 8th house <laughs> and he is always complaining <laughs> that i am uh, acting like a teacher maybe it's because exactly. of exactly retrograde. retrograde means he is coming to 7th house <laughs> so he will yes. he always is guide you as, as a teacher sitting in spouse house <laughs> yeah nice <laughs> Sir, we have another session in Telugu. Yes. At what, sir? Thank you, sir. Twelve o'clock. Yeah. Twelve o'clock. We have Telugu session. So we will discuss now, sir. Yes, sir. If no more questions, we will discuss. If anybody is having, wait for five minutes. Otherwise, close. So we'll start next uh, fourth chapter. Is a more this is also more interesting chapter. So you will come to know the signs. What are they? Gives insight, which is more important. Okay. If in any there is no questions, we will close. Yeah, we'll close, sir. Okay. Thank, you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you all. Thank you, sir. Okay, thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you all.